Hey everyone. So today I'm going to be doing a Aries reading, um, a current love energy for mid September to the end of September. Um, I know it's been a really long time since I filmed, but I'm back. Um, so let's see what's going on with you guys. Um, I'm going to be doing recent past, present and future. And then I'm going to be also doing some Oracle cards. So let's see what happened in the recent past with my Aries. We have the two of swords. Present, present. We have the King of Cups. Tell me about the future. And we have the Knight of Wands. Okay. Clarify the Two of Swords, please. Nine of Pentacles. Can I find the King of Cups, please? Can I find the King of Cups, please? Oh, nope, the whole deck just flew. <laughs> One sec. Ugh. All right, clarify the King of Cups, please, Spirit. One card, please. Oh, well, they gave me two again. <laughs> oh my gosh, two cards keep coming out. All right, if two cards keep coming out, then I will take it. Their cards are flying. I guess they have a lot that they need to say to you guys. All right, we have strength. Clear for the Knight of Wands, please. Clear for the Knight of Wands. You know, Six of Cups. All right. And then on the bottom of the deck, we have Awakening. All right. So, with the Two of Swords being here, I feel like someone was maybe stuck between two different... First of all, I feel like someone was not clear about something. They couldn't decide which... I just heard someone might have been blocked. There might have been blocked communication. Someone couldn't find clarity about something. They couldn't. Someone was just not clear about something. They couldn't see how to proceed. It could have been a decision about. With the nine of pentacles being here. To me the nine of pentacles is like a very independent single feminine. Um, so someone maybe was trying to decide if they wanted to pursue this a relationship or not. They couldn't decide if they wanted to be single or if they wanted to get into a relationship. Someone could have also been trying to decide if they wanted to leave a relationship and become single. I'm definitely feeling like someone was trying to make a decision and they couldn't decide. You could be dealing with a water sign Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Someone here is very reserved with their feelings. It could be the person that you're dealing with. Um, maybe that was what it, maybe why you were wanting to maybe leave a connection or if you were kind of undecided about if you wanted to pers keep pursuing someone because they were being very, they do have deep emotion for you. They, they do love you, um, but they're not the type of person. They're very emotional, but they're not the kind of person to express that. Be very open with their emotion, with strength here, they're very self-controlled. They're real. They're very able. They're goodness. They're very self-disciplined. I also feel like maybe someone was trying to work up the courage to express their feelings. Mm 
I feel like someone was being very quiet about their way they felt. And I feel like that may have also caused the confusion of the two of swords because you're like, I don't even know if this person even really likes me or not. I need more validation from this person and they're not giving it to me. I feel like you guys are pretty different and this person, you may be very expressive with your emotions. This person is not, um, but they definitely do love you. Your person may be going through an awakening though. Seven of Pentacles, two of cups. Yeah, I feel like your person's going through a transformation. I feel like this person definitely wants to grow with you. If they were having a hard time opening up to you in the past, I feel like that may be changing. Um, I feel like this person doesn't want to lose you. I feel like this person feels like they have invested a lot into you or you, you know, or that you have invested a lot into them. And it's only fair for them to, you know, give you more in return. Or they just feel like they have a, they are very invested in you and they don't want to lose you. They feel a very strong soulmate connection with you. So they're changing for you, is what I'm seeing here. Yeah. If someone was confused in the past, I definitely see that ending. Someone's not going to be confused anymore. I definitely see clarity coming. With the Knight of Wands being here, I feel like someone is going to have a fire lit under their butt all of a sudden. And rush towards you. Hmm, let me get clear. Before I say anything, let me get clear. Because this could be one or two things. So let's see. Yeah. The Four of Pentacles being here. This person is definitely holding on to you and they don't want to lose you. The Empress. Yeah, they think you're an Empress. They think you're beautiful. They think you're abundant. They think you're so... They think you're nurturing. And they just feel like you guys could grow together. Yeah, I feel like someone is going to all of a sudden be a lot more passionate. If you guys are in separation, I definitely see a reconciliation here. Yeah. I feel like it's going to be pretty hard for this person to come forward to you with these emotions and these feelings but they're gonna do it they're gonna take a leap of faith i feel like they are a little scared though that you're gonna block you know cut them out or reject them a little bit i'm feeling be a little bit cold towards them maybe because that they that's how they've been to you in the past but i don't see that happening i don't think you will but you may be a little bit guarded But I feel like the connection that you have with this person is going to surpass that. And I definitely see you guys coming together. I definitely see things growing between the two of you guys. All right, I'm going to get some Oracle cards. Yep. Oh my gosh. Express your love. Go ahead and make the romantic gesture. Yeah. Your person, if they haven't. And also, guys, remember, um, the roles could, roles could be vice versa. So if you're the person that's not expressing their love, um, you know, then I feel like you're going to get to a place where you're going to express, feel comfortable expressing your love to your person. Um, or it could be the other way around. Take it how it resonates. But yeah, someone definitely needs to express their feelings. You got healing family issues, your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. So maybe your person um, has a hard time expressing their feelings because of how they grew up. Um, the kind of childhood that they had. The relationship that they, the kind of relationships that they have with their parents. But I feel like they're going to be healing from those things or putting that aside. 
Um, they need to heal from it though. Um, and then we have past life relationship. You have known each other before. I was getting that with the Six of Cups. They definitely feel like um, you guys have a strong connection. And I feel like once this, the first time this person met you, they felt like they knew you or you felt that way about them. Yeah, and then we have on the bottom of the deck, it is safe for you to love. Open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. So yeah, someone is here is going through an awakening and they're going to... If, they had a hard time with emotions and expression, expressing emo emotions, processing. Um, but I feel like they're going to be changed. That's going to be changing. I feel like this person is going to be um, a lot more expressive with you very soon. All right, guys, that's what I have for you. Um, thank you so much for watching. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.